how you go assess the country in peace at this moment? At the moment, the country is peaceful. That is a fact. But you cannot discount the fact that social media, bloggers, mostly living out of this country, they tend to portend the country as if it is on the verge of collapse, on the brink of collapse. And because most of the people, them, gullible, that is, that they believe what they say, a lot of us not be able to go to school because we'll be the pay school fees. There are few of we able to go to school. Then they listen to we, we go to school for talk to them. We they try for tell them, say, most of these threats and talk, talk, where they put, say, the country could go to chaos, for go by riot and this. Not a true. Um, I go one premise misstatement about the assessment of the country in peace for say anybody when I see a Leonian, we at this point think say Sierra Leone peaceful or peace day in Sierra Leone, that possibly they, they either suffer from what I go refer to as willful ignorance or self inflicted dementia. From a professional point of view, what do they enjoy in Sierra Leone right now? Na negative peace. You get conditions for peace. Peace not to only a state of quietness or tranquility, or you go say now we war not day. Peace now also the presence of justice, not to only the absence of violence. But good things and be we don't happen at this country from 2023 to now. We anybody we understand waiting at peace go no say Sierra Leone. I mean a negative peace would enjoy. From a very professional point of view, I want to say Sierra Leone is one of the most peaceful countries in Africa, right? From the Global Peace Index, Salon is the third most peaceful country in Africa, and for West Africa, is the most peaceful country in West Africa. I want to tell um, everybody, say, no country in Africa. Mauritius is the most peaceful country in Africa. No country in Africa need to enjoy positive peace. That's now one of the things them we alone we need for work to work and become the first country we go begin for enjoy positive peace in Africa. We really need for work on that. You know, me say because we did third, me we not go able for succeed. No country in Africa need to enjoy positive peace. All the country then in Africa they enjoy negative peace. It mean we're peaceful, but things can flip at any time. But as we tell on today, we they look at national peace and cohesion and the threats against national peace. <coughs> Already in the studio, we want to welcome Honorable Alpha Khan, Presidential Spokesperson. Good morning and welcome to the program. Good morning, Salon. Good morning, Musa. Good morning, everybody in the Salon. Okay, the anytime people. from now, we expect Mikhail Kuruma, uh, representative for the All People's Congress APC Party, and uh, our Samai, we are the Executive Secretary, Independence Commission for Peace and National Cohesion. As you get from we headline earlier today inside the program, Radio Democracy, they look at the threat on national peace and cohesion. And Alia Obido, welcome, Alpha Khan, presidential spokesperson. And now, now the student, I want to welcome Mikhailo Kurma, we are the representative for the All People's Congress APC Party. Good morning and welcome to the program, Mikhailo. Good morning, Musa. Good morning, Radio Democracy. Good morning, the Republic of Salyon. I'm delighted for the on the show. Mm -hmm. Okay, continue for stay with me. We come to Alpha Khan quickly. Mm -hmm. We na the uh, presidential spokesperson. Alpha Khan, we are there for look at peace and national cohesion. But quick one for listeners and viewers seeking update we on happenings around the presidency. Thank you very much. I'm glad you all don't call me now today, don't you? My people, they a good morning. The president very busy. He's busy with the Feed Salon program to the extent that we don't launch lots of projects in almost all the districts for start the cultivation, plowing, and harrowing for this season, especially for rice and cassava. So because there is a shortage of uh, the machinery in, uh, in the river Rhine areas, Government don't buy what they call landing craft. 
when I ferry them, where they load tractors and machines for carrying go at the river Rhine and island areas. For the one, they mean don't launch on a Bondapi, the other one, Nasamu, for the, uh, the Mambulu Samu axis of the breadbasket of Sierra Leone. So that is going ongoing. But beyond that, His Excellency the President, at the moment, a day in a conference in uh, uh, Korea, South Korea, where they invite them for two reasons. The first one are for the fifth salon where they talk about. Korea and Southeast Asia, when I know say most of the rest will they eat. Now then they provide them. And Korea, alongside with the, I mean, in relation to China, where they launched the Belt and Road Initiative, then they've done, done the Korea K rice belt. And that rice belt means they're ready for supply we improved seed varieties to at least eight African countries, where Sri Lanka included. So another one the president go for. And at the same time, then go for a whole which they call the Africa Korea Summit for see how we go able for continue for the collaborate. Korea they know new naya. When I see say even the FCC building, the Free Town City Council, that they give them to you. It cost about thirty nine million dollars for free, not so long. No. And then bill them for you. So there are relationships we don't exist already. Now then the president go for go extend and this time particularly for the feed salon project nine ed day four. So there are so many things happening in the uh, presidency and uh, we as you know, they hope say uh, very soon uh, the country will be able to get into a mood where we all go able for the work, for look, for waiting, where they eat. So, so far, are the main issues they run in the way they happen at the presidency. We'll come back to you. We'll look at the uh, issue we there for we in, uh, peace and the threats to national peace and cohesion. Do we come to representative from the Old People's Congress Party? Uh, would they give you the same opportunity for tell what's in the upon not the Old People's Congress Party in terms of activities? The Old People's Congress Party, they make tremendous progress as are they talk for Unite the Party. When I go recall, say, very recently, Chief Alaji Abubakar Sansumana, we uh, be left the APC party, or rather, we will be expelled now. The party be not apply for come back. Say he wants for join the APC again. We don't re admit him, and a couple of other individuals will show interest for come back now. The party we get a long standing issue of membership where most people they grumble say they want for be registered, then cards, then they in process. We don't also put mechanisms in place for address Gandhi immediately and he will commence very soon. Mm -hmm. So the party they in good standing for take governance in this country with the consolidate to membership and will they do everything for ensure say we hold government accountable on the promises or manifesto to the people of this country. Just a few days ago, you notice say, the parliamentary group mm -hmm. being at press conference now the office. Mm -hmm. Who side the National Secretary General Lawyer Lansana Dumbuya? be invites all stakeholders of the party the press conference be open to members of the public journalists civil society and will be witness a dialogue forum in which we get frank talk people they ask questions the leader of upatina parliament the honorable abdul Kabo, the deputy leader honorable daniel koroma and the entire leadership na parliament be in attendance the answer to many questions were there is you also notice say, the deputy chairman Ambassador Alaji Usman for the answer name, they make a statement. We clarify a lot of things we get for do with the tripartite committee, we then be set up out of the Bintumani Agreement for National Unity. So far, so good. The APC is doing very well. Okay. And as we tell you now, for one of our lines to read them, we look at threats um, to national peace and cohesion. We come over back to you, um, uh, Mr. Khan. How you go assess the country in peace at this moment? At the moment, the country is peaceful. That is a fact. But you cannot discount the fact that social media, bloggers, mostly living out of this country, they tend to portend the country as if it is on the verge of collapse. 
on the brink of collapse. And because most of the people, them, gullible, that is, that they believe what they say, a lot of us not be able to go to school because we'll be the pay school fees. A few of we able to go to school. Then they listen to we we go to school for talk to them. We they try for tell them say most of these threats and talk talk we then they put say the country go go to chaos, will go pan riot and this not so true. But there are other elements we know they take the responsibility for do the same thing for tell the people say this is not true. And in a country which I you get eight million people, um, almost half of them. No, they try for educate the people they rightly. The other half they try for educate the people they rightly. You have a tug of war, a tug of war in ideology, a tug of war in ideas and the control of the minds of the people. So we believe, say, if we all work together, for every people they know the truth that at the moment in Sierra Leone there is really no reason for any threat apart from what may happen on 26th of uh, November this, uh, last year. Uh, we country quiet and we believe, say, with the right kind of approach, then TSO what they do, Kana Radio, talk to yourself and all that. The people then go, believe, say, the safety and the security strongly then at the hands of the chief, the commander-in-chief of the country, when at the president, and also the, 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 the people them we then they represent when they represent in a parliament they say for do what they're able to do for secure this peace as you say the peace of the country they not the hands of the president we you the rep you know the spokesperson for how the presidency assess the current status of threats against national peace and cohesion well the president is a commander in chief the president na possible they as gateman for protect the people there in this country. If problems they want for come, it is ready one for tell the people they say, look, I'm in charge. I go able to look after one. But if other people they talk say no, we will still come for can cause problems for one. The president gets for step out and take his stance as leader of the country and assure the people that the security of the gates where in the man, i.e. Sierra Leone gate, it in I hand. But apart from just the president, the president is the head of the government. And the government is made up of all three arms of government. The executive, the parliament, and of course the judiciary, where in the day for provide justice for you. Now, the actual operations of the country in continuing one in governance is there between the executive and the one the way they validate what they need to do. That is the parliament. And in parliament, we have representatives from all corners of the country. So I always they say the peace of the country is there one, not the hands of the president, and two, primarily, not the hands of the people the way they represent we. Because they come from all shades of opinion, because they call from all uh, corners of the country and from all ethnicities and from all regions, we believe, say, them with the inside, they that they're able to control situations such that they maintain that cohesion. Where if we, within a we see them, they maintain that kind of cohesion, we go further. Because each of them, at the end of the week or at the end of the month, then they go to the constituency, then they go talk to them people and all that. And then for able for go out there and educate them people and say, we are trying to put this country in a path of development. And for the country to develop, you need peace. And that peace can only come from us, from the village, okay. to the community, the community to the district, the district to the region. And now, them we represent in a parliament were able to interact among themselves for sure that kind of cohesion. And that is what we are hoping for. The peace of the country, therefore, is in the hands of the parliament, is in the hands of the president, and also those we have elected as councillors and all that because they represent the smaller communities. And I believe say, that is happening, and that's what we are hoping for, for national cohesion. All and right. that the president they do. John, from the APC point of view, how you go assess the country in peace at this moment? 
Um, I go on premise my statement about the assessment of the country in peace for say anybody when I see a Leonian, we at this point think say Sierra Leone peaceful or peace day in Sierra Leone, that person they, they either suffer from what I go refer to as willful ignorance or self inflicted dementia. From a professional point of view, what you they enjoy in Sierra Leone right now, a negative peace. You get conditions for peace. Peace not to only a state of quietness or tranquility, or you go say in a way war no day. Peace now also the presence of justice, not only the absence of violence. But good things and they we don't happen at this country from 2023 to now. We anybody will understand waiting at peace go no say Sierra Leone. I mean a negative peace would enjoy, and if we not do some things that we necessary for address certain things them. I mean, the country, I would say, we sit down on a time bomb. That is just too clear from a professional point of view. We get conditions that were necessary for peace. When you say peace, not the only way people not take to the street for demonstrate or for fights, or where you not get a certain group we say are the challenge government and take arms against government. But where justice not the when human rights are flagrantly violated, when there is intimidation, when political uh, uh tolerance it's uh, they at in lowest ebb then ten and day we go say this country not enjoy peace and then they will they by right now as a country in Sierra Leone. now um what are some of the conditions that we actually go day we go say the country get peace one we'll get what we call a well-functioning government where they elect government nobody not challenge her nobody not criticize her that government they function well the opposition get voice the media get voice, civil society get voice. Then ten and day now one party conditions in Nandi. But we all know after 2023, ABC challenged this government and tell them say they not win the election. In fact, to say we not participate by governance, say for the Bintumani agreement for national unity, we will come to later. Another condition now uh, sound business environment. Yeah, the business environment not conducive now this country. Middle witness a circumstance in which. Most businessmen, and because of the high taxation and because of the somehow instability, don't fold up and don't left Sierra Leone. Some of them they do business in neighboring Guinea and Liberia now because the environment not conducive for let them do business. That now another condition for peace. We will go so the country peaceful. Another one an equitable distribution of resources. Where we've been the APC, we make sure they will distribute the country resources equally. We make sure say we take ultra modern roads now places like Kailan. We build hospital, take water, electricity, now places so that not be ever day. We make sure say governance it reach now the doorstep of every corner now this country. Now that now equitable distribution of resources. We know the witness than the current lane at this country. Another one are acceptance of the rights of others. You for no say your right for exist stop pusa me own begin. And so you get for accept other people and say they get right. Then get rights to which as a freedom of assembly. If people they want protest, they want for demonstrate, you get for giving that right, they not the right. You know, you not get for most of people the right. A circumstance in which you not guarantee people their rights, that country they not peaceful at all. Another condition for peace, now good relations with your neighbors, like we and SLPP forget good relationship. We will always meet at a point to start with dialogue, we resolve in differences then. Without to not get an intervener, like what happened after the election, we get ECOWAS, we get AU, we get the UN and the Commission for Peace come between we. Then they know for the Usai Peace Day. Now another condition, now they. Another condition, now free flow of information. Now we get Freedom of Information Act now this country. But where you want information, it go difficult for late getter. We don't see a circumstance in which even the Trapatite Committee then we want information from ECSL. They want information from NACRA. The protocols then be too much. Write this letter, go council. I mean, then back and forth. I wonder if they don't get the right information where they be ever want. High level of human capital. Now, what do you mean by human capital? President Bill always don't talk about human capital. Human capital now for develop the capacity of your citizens there. Make them get the required education. Let them get training. Let, let them get expertise in now some areas then we will make some of them become self-reliant they open businesses for themselves become entrepreneur not depend on government for employment 
President Biodon trumped this too much, but we'll not to see human capital development at play. Now, another condition for peace. For, now, we also need for no say, uh, low level of corruption. If for dinner the country, for long no say peace day, we'll get high level of corruption as a loan. Now, the Anti Corruption Commission from 2018 to date, we get the Auditor General's report, we get a lot of cash loss. Where the anti corruption, not they go after them people, and they, they only they go after the opposition. Mikhailu, you don't make plenty points, them where they indicate the where they indicate what you mentioned, say saloon and negative peace we get. And one of them, thing that we you mentioned, now the acceptance of election results, where according to you, since after 2023 elections, the opposition not accept the results, we mean say peace no good day and when you look like taking back down the line in 2012 when president bill being contest the 2012 election with the first time presidents the slpp self no accept the results so say and as in in five years done and also when you look at the 2018 election dr samura not being accept the first results so going back down the line of elections then at this country the only person will accept election results after the rebel war now the uh, first ten vice president leads now with solomon berwa that means say saloon not only enjoy peace since then then they make i tell you musa we all in at this country tango now we all born now we go school now men you know, go compare their elections and they in 2007, 2012. No, they look at today. acceptance of now, the opposition now, 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 of election results. Relatively, the elections were accepted. Relatively, they were accepted. Somebody go grumble for score political goal, but in the end, if they accept the results and work with the president, we all see the relationship will be exist between President Bill and President Anes by Koroma. We see that relationship there. We see where President Koroma really creates the platform for let President Bill participate in governance, even during the Ebola. He came, he go to state house, the enabling environment was created, he gets security all over the place, he traversed the country, nobody no more so in right. You not go compare that to the 2023 election. You know the SLPP, even the 2018 elections, they're not winner. Because they been get mercenaries then at ECSL, or which will be the call neck, they manipulate the system for rig the election. Fully knowing that they, they say they win less than two percent margin, they come with a grand plan for rig the elections. They started by, by what they refer to as civil registration. Would they say everybody for registering at the country? We come out there, they can't say midterm census. We World Bank advice, EU advice, then go there, impose midterm census. Even in the registration of voters, we see in the stronghold of the APC, picking the way down 18, 19, 20, 21, as the case may be, where they go for go register, they tell them, say, go bring your bad certificate, go bring your worst result, go count scratch card. Where the lawmaker abundantly clear, the Public Elections Act say, if somebody not get bad certificates, an imam, honorable member of parliament, a mayor or councillor, can recommend that person, say, that this constituency day, it don't reach the age. They not be encouraged all of them in day. So, going to the election will not surprise at all because there was a grand plan to rig in the election. So, you're not going to compare the elections and day to what happened in 2018 or 2012 or 20, 2007. I mean, it never happened, waiting on unfold in 2023. Now, that make after the election, we will not see the rigor in broad daylight. Right. They not even go by the established law. We say for Tale, election results at district level for certified day, come to region before they can national. Then bridge all of that. Right. We representatives and then are there, particular center, then they will say they the Tale the results. They announce results. Me, me, it is wrong. All right. Um, me kind of quick one before come um over to honorable if I can you mentioned about um because the rig the election make um when I mean decide not to take part in governance but somebody will say then decision they are wanna they take not just in the interest of the APC party not the salon people. Now in the interest of the country. I mean I think say time go day for law can talk about how the country they in an abysmal situation in terms of the economy. What in at the inflation rate right now? Inflation day at about forty one or so percent. One are the highest ever in the history of this country. Waiting at the exchange rate, waiting at the uh, uh, external debt to get. So now, in the interest of the country, we say they rig the elections because we be want now get a transparent, free, fair, and credible election. Let the winner we go emerge, go can serve the people of this country and maximize the welfare of the citizens. So not only in the interest of APC, but rather now the, in the in interest of Sierra Leone. Now get that they very clear, and because will not be accept, now that make we get the Bintumani agreement for national unity. Now we only talk about the tripartite committee. 
the only hope for this country now now the outcome of the tripartite committee the recommendations we then get for make and we all for, for no say their recommendations they are they're actionable and implementable and whatever the tripartite committee they do the one the way they represent we they beat APC or SLPP therefore put country first we not expect them to bring to we any wishy washy recommendations because we all know what's happening at this country and their recommendations for being informed by reports of internal and external observers the EU report day, the Qatar Center report day, the new National Elections Watch report day. So if they bring her anything wishy washy, I mean, I think say, the people of this country will question her very seriously. So, so is it that when they get credibility challenged now with the work of the Tripartite Committee? Is that the case? The people that they represent you now, the Tripartite Committee, we get tremendous respect for them. Dr. Kalfala Mara, Dr. Richard Conte, the Honorable Armami Petito, Kooma, uh, Bernadette Cabo. Honor, uh, uh, lawyer Boniface Sidiki Kamara, Prince Tolly, and uh, uh, my own brother David Fona. We get tremendous respect for them. We not think say them will compromise. But this is just a caution that any recommendation will not meet the threshold of credibility, right. fairness. The APC will find it very difficult for tolerate their recommendations. Indeed. Inside the program now, they come over to Honorable Alpha Khan, Presidential Spokesman, Office of the President. You don't hear you waiting. Um, your former colleague, um, in Kailu, don't see we are in. You say um, the country get peace, but you know they enjoy that kind of peace we is supposed to forget due to different issues that we mentioned. Get for do with election, get for do with the business environment, you know, um, um, freedom of expression and other things. Them. What do you make up of some of the statements there? I'm not surprised for Harry, uh, Mr. Tinkai Lukuruma, they talk the way they talk. See everything in our leadership. The leadership of the APC before the elections stood in public, in toxi, if we want to continue to destroy this country, we have voted this government back in. That's a direct threat to the people of the country. Oh, that's what that's Dr. Samura Kamara, in the video recording in a public meeting. Second, he also say we will make governance, I mean, this country ungovernable. So that, that is really the grounds for the premises for the confusion there. Then, it come for rallying troops. Before I tell them, say, well, let me go to a campaign, they say, I've been to go to America. I stopped in London. I miss the manager of the Carter Center. They tell me, say, they're not able to come, for come for uh, observe the elections in Australia because they're not getting money. They say, but well, since you go to America, you serve some people in there. This is not budget week, not the Congress. They say, you have been putting a word for us. Now we have money. There we go. These are coming, what's coming from him. So when I go, I meet NDI, he said. I'm quoting him directly. And I talk to NDI, which in Qatar say. And then they promise. So when I come back, I pass to London. The Qatar Center tells me, say, they don't receive funding, so they're going to Sierra Leone. So it seems, if we don't lay the premises, and somehow somebody don't give them the confidence, say, we they go observe those elections and we're going to help you become president. Me they put local. Me not be a member of the APC. I know how Pa and Skuruma have been the campaign right through the country. This last election, Dr. Samura Kamara put local safety no master. He go Lungi. And that's all. You know master the whole put local district. There are certain districts you know must. You're not good for campaign. And if you don't go there, you expect people to vote for you. No. They lost the elections woefully, transparently, and peacefully. So for they talk, say, peace not because they don't accept elections, not because they are bad losers. And one of the reasons that I left, me, I know they mix with bad losers. When he lost, talk, say, but I don't lost. Let us work. Look at what has happened in South Africa. Just now, when the ANC expel Zuma, Zuma came back, it caused problems for them. The president will accept, say, well, we don't lost. So there are real two people, they say. But we go talk to Una anyway. And then, at the state opening of parliament, on the 3rd of August, Thursday, 2023, 
the president himself said, because people, they say, they get issues with these elections, notwithstanding the fact that they don't go court for go contest the elections results, when it is stated clearly in section 45 of the constitution, say, after the returning officer, who is the chairman of the, the chairman of the, uh, uh, NEC this time, I'll say, they announce the results. Anybody who has anything, any concerns about this, move refer to the Supreme Court. They don't talk, say they're not equal. So never mind. He say in his speech, in paragraph 64, 65, 66, he say to improve ECSL's continued planning and conduct of transparent and fair elections, there shall be a National Electoral Systems Review Committee which I will establish. And that will include all stakeholders, including political parties, CSOs, and international community. So that was the premise for setting up this tripartite committee will be. So not to think where they impose on President Bio, now he voluntarily offers say it is set them up. The only issue where people even get is that where President Bill say he want let the vice president head him. And the people say no, it, he cannot because he's a partisan man. Okay. So it's agree. So when the unity committee came, the, uh, the Bintumani committee came, they set up this tripartite committee on the basis of waiting President Bill been say. And of course the mandate is what? To look into the laws that govern the elections in 2023 and others. And then to make sure that the recommendations on this report, we put them into legislation where we make sure so we don't make these mistakes again. So this type of really talk about we depend on it, we depend on that. We started it. And it came. And it came. We started it. And then, on the basis of that, we went to Bintumani. Well, long before, in 2018, President Biobi always they talk, say, well, let us talk, let us talk. The elections of 2018, where President Biobi win. At that time, I was spokesman for the APC. We lost. We lost that election. Shockingly, me. We lost them. But when we lost them, the man will win. He said, well, I'll go and have been to money again. Let's have a been to money three conference. Let me talk how we go able to resolve issues among us. The thing where they talk for, say, President Kuruma be allowed President Bio for participate. Yes, he did. But on the request of President Bio, when he was in England, when Ebola they threatened, and in the South and East people not being they accept the Ebola uh, workers there, then they chased them, then they burned ambulances. As a leader, he said, let me go talk to my people because I mean, they listen to. So he kind of stayed out. He tell President uh, Anes Kuruma what he want for do. He said, okay, we will support you. Go there. And that is why at that time they sent signals to all the RGPs, the regional co police commands. Say, this man, they come on again, free passage, because he was helping us. At that time, we were losing the fight against Ebola. So he came to help us. When COVID came, they don't take part. President Bill asked them for help. They don't take part. Even when the, the vaccines come, they are the first to tell the people don't take the vaccines. So these are the things that they're doing. True to which they may say, then go make the government, the country, ungovernable. True to which they may say, then go make sure say, then continue to destroy this country if they vote this no, country. So, somebody so you go, see, uh, and somebody go say, but look, Presidential well, spokesman, please. Somebody go say, uh, uh, Paulo Conte be down the verge for support government when you go to state house, we go get a challenge. But you know what happened? A challenge which the court has decided. A challenge for which he was convicted. So we want to tell me that was unfair? I know did he. But how can you walk into the how can you how can you go into anybody's house with a gun? So we are can no 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 quick one quick one quick one with no, all with you all the they call yeah, them quick, they call wait, wait, with, they call with, them all the don't say quick one let me say quick one with all the you don't say you still maintain that you are a statement this alone the enjoy peace. of course it is unless other people want to make it ungovernable and they said so even before this thing happened the country is at peace. And the commander-in-chief is ready for make sure that peace continues. One, by dialogue, for talking with them, 
uh, whoever wants to do anything, and also for dissuade whoever wants to come. Now, this country, the country, they in peace, unless somebody wants, because peace can be overturned the next day. Okay. And the things the way they go and uh, account, they, they, uh, they go and uh, recount, say, inflation, hardship, and all that. Now, I know they be. It's a whole country, the whole world. Ah, we are having these problems. So don't please particularize them in Sierra Leone as if it is a making of the president of Sierra Leone. No. Ah, these are global you. issues where if you are not blind, yes, no cock, you know what's in the happen of the world. Don't mislead your people. Ah, it's honorable. Don't be disingenuous N and don't now, be dishonest. Now, um, you mentioned a lot of things we get to do with um, the former presidential um, um, <coughs> candidate for the APC party, Dr. Samoa Kamara. We are in the city. Um, it may make a speech where in the say will make this um, country ungovernable. ungovernable. Yeah, but again, people they blame um, President Bill. We are in um, people saying I need to create the tension on the country because it, because if you look at in campaign messages them um, during the 2023 against you know the APC party and former um, um, and President Koma, people say this. Give me an example of one. Give me an example of one message. All right, we are in. Um, it may make a lot of um, statements against them. Um, we are in about. Um, the peace we are in, he said, President Koma, you know, for Sidom as former president, if you know Sidom, other things. Go That's happen. not a threat. That's no, not no, advice. No, no, these are some of the things. That is people, what you should do. These are some of the as things a that man. people blame. You don't suffer, you don't left. These are some of the things that we No, you cannot blame, blame him. Um, you cannot blame him because, because say, as president, um, at times, you know, can say some things, then we can cool down the situation of the country. Because those who have to say it, don't say it. If me have been chairman of the APC at that time when we campaign, as President Kuruma was, former President Kuruma was, when then they get these messages from diaspora, from people who purport to be members of the APC, and other me, Alpha Kano, if I was chairman, I'll come and condemn it. I will do it and tell them, don't say it in our name. They never did that. So if somebody comes and says, me, I'm APC, and I will do this, we'll go do that, we'll go burn under, we'll go do this. Abel, what else do you want? Okay. They say that the monkey passed no more. Now in the corn broke. Okay. Abel and I left. Okay. Let us be sincere to ourselves. Continue for, stay, continue for stay with you inside the program, Alpha Khan, presidential spokesperson. And inside the program now, we want to welcome our Samaya Executive Secretary, Independence Commission for Peace and National Cohesion. Good morning and welcome to the program. Good morning, Salon. Good morning and thanks for having me. You day among uh, the you don't listen from the politicians them um, this morning and you don't get from their messages them um, from the national peace commission standpoint i will not can describe the current states of the country peace and threat against the country peace from a very professional point of view i want to say sierra leone are one of the most peaceful countries in africa right from the global peace index salon are the third most peaceful country in africa and for West Africa, now the most peaceful country in West Africa. I want to tell um, everybody, say, no country in Africa, Mauritius now the most peaceful country in Africa, no country in Africa, they, they enjoy positive peace. That's now one of the things them we alone we need for work to work and become the first country we go begin for enjoy positive peace in Africa. We really need for work on that. You know, me say because we did third, me we're not go able for succeed. No country in Africa need to enjoy positive peace. All the country then Africa they enjoy negative peace. It mean we're peaceful, but things can flip at any time. But it no mean say we're not peaceful. What are the indicators then of negative peace? I just mentioned some say tension, unnecessary tension can happen. It means say um, economic issues where um, almost all man they suffer in Africa. As I say, no country in Africa need to enjoy positive peace. And plenty things that we would see around. Some countries then they, in fact, you know they pass without they not search you. Salon, I think now only midnight. Now we can see security checkpoints and the mount up. But in some other African countries, San San Tensef, we only work in an African country. But Kusia Leone and they travel. You go find us in San San Tensef, they pass in the street. Then go screen you on side. Even your vehicle, for let vehicle pass, you get for candom your vehicle, then screen your vehicle before you enter the vehicle and pass. If you go Kenya, you go all different countries, there you see anything in the day. But we need to see 
then kind thing and then a salon it shows say we peace level more tolerance and we enjoy a more calm calm a situation it just like somebody come on ghana he say hey he say i don't even know what to they enjoy in a salon he say i go now on a beach as soon as they play volleyball till past 12 midnight and people they sit down they relax he say it doesn't happen here yeah, often and um, now we on country often that that's on the kind of piece they would enjoy in a salon we'll not even treasure we, because we're so used the situation around we that we not even the treasure them. I think say salon we need for the any side they do even if in a small positive team them. And this global peace index not to salon I make them. Nothing way not for the one whole world way all man they look outside the ranking at the world. So that's how peaceful we are as a nation. And even salon people them they say we very friendly. So we need for the leverage on them thing and they, and we need for tell God thank you. Because this is not God who foretell God take it. No means say, um, I can always tell people and like, say, no means say, where well, you come on inside the same belly, same mama belly, tit and tongue, the jam. Tit and tongue, the jam. That's normal. Okay. And inside this democracy, disagreements get for day, for low get agreement. And then they're not progress. Because if all man just they say yes, yes, yes to all things, meaning somebody they make a mistake, nobody not going for pick and say mistake they go on, I so low change, I low we correct them. But for let somebody they win an opposition, now I make even this um, unity agreement. We try for work with them all and for foster us so that we'll get them because important for lay um, the, the, the opposition then governance so that when things need to go right, you go say, this need to go right to so not true democracy. And do you look at this? Or we see them from this lens. You know me say everything where um, even the opposition, they say no right, right, right or wrong. Okay. But maybe then they look at from another lens. So maybe watching from one lens and looking at another lens, we it's a win-win situation. All man go see how they can push, push small until they arrive at something. Just like what they do for the unity agreement. Okay. There was push, push, no, not this one, this one, this one, this one, until they agree waiting then come out with as a unity agreement that then they will get for foster more okay. how the different political party not just the two political party apc SLPP, but all the other political party they how they will they talk to themselves all right now this nine salon for be like how will they communicate with them so that we're able to enjoy the peace so they enjoy today all right um we they enjoy peace despite the affair issues them where they happen around but again one of the things them where you mentioned that um at times we can cause threat to peace they get for do it um unnecessary tension economic issues and the rest for salon we don't experience some of the things there it's an obvious yes definitely and this um not to one it's a global thing as i mentioned all side is of alarm right um you go ghana you go guinea you go no no go fast if liberia eh? all side they suffer alarm but it's everybody's responsibility but the main people them where um not their responsibility apart from opposition are the three arms of government and that's at the executive arm of government uh the judiciary and the legislative arm of government where in uh, now the parliament so this now all my business and all my business even the opposition if they get right to oppose when they see things need to go around okay. but at the same time when they critique when things positive thing happen let we all say this thing a positive thing not to okay. all time for the criticize all uh we speak as them don't they mention the issue of tension and other issues them uh, the country especially from the uh, person from the peace commission well one statement we don't bring concern among the public as people live here from different angle and perspective and the opposition get and take on them now one statement where president bill make this being term now both where they be the do coronation for some paramount chief them make we listen to that statement which it mean for peace and national cohesion and we can engage with studio guests them anything we start in this country when a good thing you get bad people the way they come inside we be down disturb small when i know it's up on november 26 we we get people that we can see that they can pull we we who saw the map now we not elect we now they go they can we they can different way this time I can with the ballot also now the ballot someone and get for pull me and the time done done I just decide say the time done they are coming here but anybody say can with bullets you go meet bullets 
And this is an opportunity also for Mecca to speak directly to the whole nation. We don't got election and no election not the, on the, until 2028. The one that where they call big man there, where they call themselves political big guns there, where they mix this country for say another election day in June they will come out. We serve the ready because not a one man get this country. One man, then, one group of people not go decide say that the cause confusion and make with life miserable. 2012, they say I lost election. I say okay. When I be vexed, I say man, when I take easy, you know so. We take a easy. 2028 come. We don't make a no so. Now they no well, one be there. Well, that's President Bill in statement so we make now about this being them for the crown some permanent chief them, and this now one we don't bring concern among different sets of the public. We can to Mikailu Kuruma, APC rep, now the studio as them party been take position in this statement. Uh, Mikailu Kuruma, for somebody now see the APC position, what is now the issue and position statement for second statement here? Yeah. yeah, before I go to the issue or the position statement regarding uh, the talk with the president, go talk now, bow with the crown paramount chief then, kindly permit me for respond to a few issues. Now, um, like I state earlier, anybody who thinks it's a young peaceful, that person they, they suffer from what I go refer to as willful ignorance or self inflicted dementia. You know, six seven word and they add for the program. No, 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 just adjectives, you know, all that. No, no, these are just adjectives, they're just adjectives. I want let Alpha can give me time for talk because we've been talking. No, 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 they enjoy a relative peace, but we also need for do a few things for make we will enjoy positive peace. I glad for a reader statement they from the policy way they had the peace commission. I get tremendous respect for and I let the work we then do for make sure they then bring APC and SLPP together after the elections for all chat the way forward. I will go address with in other cases then at this country. Quite recently, I be the Ghana. I traverse a lot of places. At times I can not treat for long. I uh, no see checkpoints. I can then at least go club then one, two, three, return to my hotel. Of course, Labadi, people in Kidina Beach almost stay 4 a.m. I no see checkpoint. Unlike Freetown, 12 o'clock, all over the place, checkpoint and day. So I want to still say we know they enjoy the peaceful for enjoy as Sierra Leoneans. We need for do more for enjoy than day. Now, um, before my colleague make a lot of statements, then, if they talk about APC leadership, and indict Dr. Samuel very seriously. I don't know if you they have to analyze Dr. Samura and statement them or for talk about Dr. Samura, but rather now for talk about national peace and cohesion, waiting at the threat to national peace and cohesion, but single out Dr. Samura Kamara. I don't know why make Alpha Kano also make mention of the statement that we President Bill don't make now this country analyze them. There was a point August 10 or so to the 14 demonstration within this country. Will the APC be right and dissuade itself completely from that demonstration day? And me being there na uh, uh, AYV on Sunday for condemnment completely, even before the demonstration happened. We know we condemn them completely as a political party. Then President Bill come, he referred to the opposition as terrorists. That the opposition then are they don't support that demonstration day, which was wrong. Alpha cannot condemn her. Very recently, this is statement about when I hear say. He said some people there eh, will refer to themselves as opposition big guns. The APC is the main opposition at this country. And we, they make it abundantly clear and this morning at this program. See, if the APC one demonstrates, will they make it official? Because now, right for demonstrate and now, right for protest. We know they hide behind a faceless demonstration. But as it stands, APC not sanction any demonstration for tripartite committee outcome or the recommendation where people they claim say June 19, then go demonstrate. APC no sanctioner, APC no the BNM, and APC no they hesitate for demonstrate, or for what demonstrate, but we do our official. Long know that they very clearly. Again, uh, Dr. Samura no campaign. How Dr. Samura no campaign? Dr. Samura campaign to the point that they even attack Anapujon physically. 
send stomp out some of the the, the motor car then broke broke the glasses then set fire burn tire then run at our people and our pujon momodu maliki former minister of water resources they run they even chop one of the people away been built up now both they do the same who say they will not campaign we traverse the whole country now both then go arrest apc sheriff then now both checkpoint 30 days and then a prison even though the agreement for national unity say all political prisoners especially the one that will be arrested during the election i mean for electoral offenses by now for not left them but things they will get for come to land the later Me, can you look at the now, statement we we'll ask you earlier the candy. now allow me please yeah now you're also talking about south africa now south africa follow and closely you know go compare the election will take place in south africa to what happened in 2023 in south africa the the, the, the former leader jacob zuma away from unkondo swear swear when are the military wing now the anc giving get an md he get 14 percent of the result Julius Malema in particular nine. The main opposition got twenty-one. No one able to meet the threshold for form government. But now then they negotiate. Nobody no rig. Nobody no impose. Nobody no take seats them from encompassing and get them. Now that they not democracy. Now that to the expect say most if for being a Sierra Leone. So you not go compare Sierra Leone and South Africa. Then can wait and so I disagree with me, Big Brother Alpha Khan completely. He say APC not going to court for challenge the result. How go going to court? So then can judiciary I will get. We not go go to court because we know say if we go there, they go throw the case out of court. Now I make we not go there. So let me make this clear and let lay to rest. He say APC not support COVID nineteen. I glad the way you talk say even way Paulo go for go support, then go make allegation against her, arrest her, spend more than one year in a prison, try and convict her. What they will not do? We miss her when she don't have support COVID nineteen. The fight against her. He say we say will they continue for destroy the country? No, we will not they continue for destroy the country. Will they continue for make peace? If you will be one destroy the country after the elections, we'll see what thing they happen in the other countries then. We for don't say we we'll take to the streets. We for don't say we we'll demonstrate. We for don't say we we'll destroy the peace. We we'll not do that. We we'll see not suffer. Instead, we we'll say we we'll not participate in governance. But we we'll not go go on streets. We we'll not go fight. We we'll not go do anything for destroy the peace of this country. Now to the statement of the president, though you ask the question. That statement they now way below the belt. I know they expect President Bio for make them kind of statement and they. President Bio now a disciplined person by my expectation because now a military man. So for refer to some people and as some big guns and at the opposition, where they undermine the peace, we got a peaceful leadership now this country. But not to the APC. Now we are the main opposition. So let me talk on behalf of the opposition. But but yeah, not to win no more at the opposition. Main opposition. No, but we are the main opposition. But as we say, we are part of the opposition. So I take offense because we are part of the opposition. Even though we are the main opposition, that statement they uncalled for. That statement is an extremist statement. Yeah, an extremist statement. You don't make it because that statement and they get the tendency for undermine the peace and cohesion of the country. If you people then take upon themselves and then go demonstrate, you get for conduct an investigation. And we know they support faceless demonstration at all. Any time we go wreck havoc in this country, we not go support her. So let President Bill not even mention the opposition. The APC not the part of that. But let, let, let me land, let me land. If you want to ask questions, ask. No, uh, Mikhailu, you say the APC get concerned about this statement, and people they ask, why APC for take and personal? Why APC for take and personal? First, the president say some opposition big guns, that's not one. Secondly, we know say the, the statement not to consolidate the peace in the country. I don't think it's in an extremist statement, Nandi. And you as president, you're not a fountain of honor. You're not the guardian of the constitution, yeah? We're not the grand norm. You know the egalitarian. You know the person who they hold the principles of equal rights. Even if the people let's say then they demonstrate, try for get them people they away one demonstrate. What they want demonstrate for? When I sit down at the round table, sometimes and get justifiable concerns. We make the one demonstrate, but for make their statement and they in complete dismissal of the concerns that we them might raise. That they not augur well, and you know they consolidate the peace now. This Mikhail, we continue for stay with you inside the program. We come to the presidential spokesman. We look at the president in his statements now. Now, Bo we be the crown some paramount chief them this BNTM, and this don't count mixed feeling among opposition and also the ruling. What now you take on that as presidential spokesman? Well, first of all, may I congratulate my small brother for we talk say them as a party, the APC. They no sanction no demonstration. So I hope say the people out there are listening. Anybody will go out. You pretend say na APC or na this party they go do. You are causing problems for yourself. So I'm glad you for away talk. That is what you should do as a leader. 
So on today, all this talk, you don't crown them. Now that you can have for. Tell people that you are not supporting the demonstration. There are the courts of law. There are the institutions where you for little, like the Peace Commission. They are here. If you have issues, go there. Now, to come to President Bill's statement, I really don't understand why my former colleagues, they say they take umbrage, concern out of this. Come on. If you don't listen to the any people that they talk to the company and the country, they can cause chaos. They have got a problem. Or now you host in fact, like say you compound. Then you get man say, okay, I go up in the door and I come. Ebo, I know to better get man. The get man in this case is the commander in chief. He is not only the founder of honor, the, 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 the harbinger of peace for the country, he is also a commander in chief, which means if there's a threat to the nation, if we withstand them, should to forestall that. Now make it a talk. You say if you come with bullets, you go with bullets. You think that are the appropriate? Oh yes, for I would say it myself. You're okay with them? Oh yes, 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 I am. In fact, it makes me feel comfortable. For now, I live inside Sierra Leone and no say passing day we go defend me even when I sleep, because you know just the gap. They threaten the peace every day, because now people their heart hang. What happens on the 19th? What happens on the 20th, on the 24th? Because these messages are still coming. We go cause chaos. We go do this, we go do that. We see that very recently in Nigeria. The uh, organization where they try for FET for the Biafra or something like that. The bond markets in Onitsha. The bond vehicles. Because they say all my sister, those people go to the market, they bond them. So people are afraid to see things like that happen to them. What do you think you could do as a government? Now for forestall that. Because me, I believe, say, if you not plan for come with a bullet, then the, 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 the statement will affect you. It will affect you. Why are you for worry? If not to that, you mean you want to do. The past say, if me, I throw in my bunga head, I not call a rata. Then you can't can take And then that is the problem. So if anybody plan for come with a bullet, President Bill say, yes, me self go confront them with a the bullet. But if you come with peace, Within I are. Don't forget, say, President Bio. Nine, you've been to money one. Been to money two. Been to money three. When I meet one grain go there from the APC, I come out to the party office, I tell them, I say, no, no, go. They all they are like, we know they go, we know they go, we know they go. And from that day, they are not going to the party office again. I went there myself, I said, I can't represent myself and my people, not the party. Because if they had gone that time, a lot of things will happen during 2018, 19. Uh, they didn't know me for B. But they left it. They wanted to create the tension. So now the tripartites don't come. For me, I've been too many for. So this one, I believe, say, that's something where President Bill is safe. Now I initiate them, now I set them up, now I call for it. So you not go afraid now, whatever comes out of it, because it be no safe. This why I ask when they come, they go look at those laws according to the mandate where they get so, and come back and say, this is what we plan to Alpha do. Alpha Carlo, we look at the issue of the Ecomox standby force in uh, Salon. And earlier you say, Salon, they enjoy peace. If Salon, they enjoy peace, somebody go say, why we need Ecomox standby force? Not we need Ecomox standby force. Now, now would I Ali Khan, my friend, you have asked the question, Musa. Let me answer you. Now we agree. As a cabinet at the time, during President Kuruma, for say we go join with colleagues, for let we get a standby force, Nasir alone, because of its centrality within West Africa. So that any side side problem is like a logistics depot. They don't they build for years now, then they build Nalungere. Now President Kuruma said, give them the space for let them begin build. So not to President Bill go call them. This was in the cards. For say, we will be stationed in West Africa, based in Sierra Leone, easy for go Guinea, easy for go Mali, easy for go land for come up from there in Nigeria. It's like coming from the bottom to the top. But here we are in the middle so of this, West Africa. So this not, so this nothing to do with the, the current situation of the country. The current situation. What is the current situation of the meaning country? Meaning the tension. Where is the tension? The, the tension is being tension. created deliberately. The tension is being created deliberately. Well, now that tension, this, then they are asking now. No, for no, no, make... no, President Bio get the ability as a leader for handle tensions in this okay. country. And he they do that through dialogue, through discussions, through advocacy, like a whistle when they talk. And that is what I'm doing. So I'm going through what my brother say now, my younger brother say, that in 
talking on behalf of the APC. They're not planned, no demonstration. So do you have anybody where in field say that if one go demonstrate because of APC, don't do it all because they're going to disown you. Okay. You know to continue yeah, for to so I continue for stay with me, said the program Alpha Khan. We come to our Samai quickly. And uh, the the Peace Commission gets a big role for play for Seka, the work of the Trapatite Committee. And earlier, I hope say we listen now you Mutka, according to me, Kailu, the APC you know they accept any word, any wish you wash report or recommendation we come on now the Trapatite Committee then work. How the Peace Commission will work with other parties within the committee or the trapatite for ensure say the recommendations them reflect the interest of all and represent the interest of salon people them and strengthen unity and national peace okay um again thank you very much because that's na key way i should say all man they wait for listening to our law go back before this unity because people elect like for talk about the trapatite and then they talk about the unity agreement the bigger picture and the unity agreement now only um, resolution three nine get rapatile business so people then get for no i want for encourage people them for they read that document today because it look like beaucoup people then they read that unity agreement today you get eight resolution you get preamble them before um the documents we tell you exactly what the document in itself number one before we reach let la go back before the the unity agreement says it. before we get to the unity agreement plenty preparation be done we now preventive diplomacy in a big english than they mean you get to talk to all man we involve all party we not just talk to apc and slpp no more or the government no more but we talk to all other political party we talk to former president then former vice president and people the way though Plenty stakeholders when a big gun then a different political party, even important people in the in the country for let us follow all man put their own sense how we go bring um uh, we go we go resolve that impasse they will be in day after elections. And after plenty plenty talk, the two main party them that's now the government and APC then be greed and give them consent for me then come together for me then see how they go dialogue right and one of the things that we'll do make sure say for me to have that dialogue day the framework where they come under for can talk it be very impartial so all man been get a voice day nobody in voice not been passed in company voice and we make sure say very inclusive now make we make sure say then choose who that for can represent them no we give the names them of who that go can represent another that talk day although we will bring international people then come the international people yeah now we the commission be invite them what in that mean anything where them can do au commonwealth and ECOWAS, if all squarely under we mandate remember say we a sovereign state salon and if we they invite and then people and then they come under the peace commission mandate the peace commission mandate not get a mandate of supreme court we get only a mandate of high court now they will own power stop and we make sure say we work within the constitution of sierra leone if you watch now the agreement um now the preamble see it did it it's all waiting we they do all the agreements they circle some for for focus very much on the constitution we can't walk out of the con constitution because we're not a sovereign state and this one been coming them in communicator with all man na the room waiting day day for the agreement and all man be understand say then cut under the peace commission and they work with the with the constitution and are under that mandate they no more with powers limited for from do then kind mediation and everybody be agree say yes now that's with the work with right so anything out of that way on a year you know say you know come out from that agreement day now make they tell people they say let them go back and read that agreement day at the end of the day waiting the agreement we get all man be agreed to them now make them be sign and everybody agree for work for implement them nothing not been there when ambiguous or false promises for raise people the expectation now make i always they tell people they say it good let all man go back 
to the agreement. So at this moment, what now the status of it? At this moment, I want to tell you, say, first, when the 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 trapper time, um, that's not the you see, safe one, then we ask president for make statement. President make statement now. They talk about the unity agreement, right? Because nine Boku people then they look at people just they look at trapper time. President make in statement and then then be an uh, APC party being for go back to governance. APC party self being green, we see say then go back to governance. The one that will be for go and um, at the council, then go the one that will be for go na parliament, go all side with them for work. Then for they, they, they function on effectively right now, um, as political parties, um, opposition political party in governance. Then, um, close and uh, the resolution three, we talk about the trapper tile. We see say, um, when I mean just start, then set up three committees. Them one now been the then develop their own terms of reference, and the other one be look at the communication framework, and the third one be look at the delivery framework, right. After then done that delivery framework, they set up another three committee. The first one, uh, Pandande, for look at the legal frame, the look at the legal framework. Right. Then the next one for look at the elections management, and the third one for look at the institution institutional reforms. So now then three committee there are so now then they work right now so with the experts. Then get experts them welcome so when are six experts. Right now, where they are the secretaries, where they work with them, they're all not foreign experts. They're not grief or take no Sierra Leonean. We even advocate, say Sierra Leonean for day day for continuity, but they're not one. So, all man where they work with this trapper, this, um, 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 the committee, the committee, the trapper tile committee, they pick seven from each group, right? Wow. Seven from government and seven from, from the APC. And they're added by three main people, them. One, that are the trapper tile, um, um, Dr. Mara, and also Dr. Gaima, and then the UN Sial. Now, then three, they head, they lead this trapper tile group. So, then right now, then they work, and then, then, tiers, uh, then three main things they are so. And then, three tiers, what then they do, one of the things that they don't do for inform the public, then don't go around. Now, all the districts, then. And when they go around, they not only talk to stakeholders they're waiting and they do, but they also ask the list stakeholders they make recommendation. Then stakeholders they also na um, civil society, traditional leader, the media, they don't meet on all. May then self give their your recommendation. The recommendation yeah, way una self they make, they also they add them to these documents they also because public opinion very critical. We also notice say they they also meet with um other sectors then they don't meet with ecsl then don't meet with pprc then don't meet with ncra okay. and then don't meet with statistics and the judiciary the okay. judiciary at tomorrow because i think the first way them for meet with they don't meet with tomorrow now right. they then for me with. so you see say then they do a lot of consultation for make sure say they go get a very amicable thing not just then too normal all right we, we, they we for playing time for car with you for kangi uh <laughs> update on waiting so far don't they open uh, happen but quickly what do you expect from political parties in terms of the recommendation them or during the term we then get for go and over some of um the thing that we didn't find out during the the trapatite um committee remember say um salon big pass any political party and waiting this trapper tile, the intent of this trapper tile, or the intent of this um, unity agreement, now for foster dialogue, for make Salon go continue towards development and peaceful cohesion. Okay. Nine are the, the, the main goal okay. of this trapper tile. So whatever they come out inside there, we for members say, now for the interest of thank Salon you. and thank not you. for thank any uh, political party. Thank you very much, our Samai, Executive Secretary, Independent Commission for Peace and National Cohesion. Uh, thank you. Uh, uh, I'm not again. Quick one. Um, Alpha, what will be your message so far? Well, first of all, the Capitalist is not a court of law, a court of public opinion at the end of the day. Two, Section 43, say, after a presidential election. No other election again for B, Section 43 of the Constitution. 
No other election no go for be as for like even if the president die, there's a vice president. The only time we election go be is that if that time don't done, a fluxion of time. That is the section forty five says the returning officer na him they declare the presidents are not done it. Yeah, well, they round up, okay. Yeah, so let's do me. Yes, yeah, mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now that I've been the wait for. The people of Sierra Leone, and a peace we want. Today, all the people away the blog, they talk, they say, oh, we're in a APC, we they can't fight, we they can't come on and do for APC. Today, we're really the spokesman of the APC. Say no to APC, send them. Do you allow nobody not come out if you're not APC? If you're not true APC, no go cause problems. If they want to demonstrate, they say they go do them legally. Then go write, then go tell the reason why they will do that. So I'm glad for that. So me people, they do, I will not come on a seat. Let's just tell you and say, this is also at a time where we referred drug abuse in the country, the Kush. And we are in a state of emergency. If you come out no more, you say you they go cause problems, they go assume say you now one of the drug lord they way one for cause problems now. I know done it for there. I mean you say that do me last word. My last word, my last word is Romans. My last word is Romans thirteen. Say let all man subject himself to the authority we God give you on earth. Anybody we know do him. If they, if they deny God. Then inside the Quran also they say Kulilahi malikal mulk tutil mulk amanta sha. We God don't give us in power, na in giam. Anybody who go against that don't go against God. Me people them, put loco, lunsar, makeni, bo, kenema. Are they talk to na? Let nobody no cause problems. We God don't put the lie, don't put them. They are, let's go. Thank you. Chair Musa, as I round up, as I round up, I want to register say you cheat me because if I don't get a statement before we all go get, because Alpha can don't talk twice. Before me, but thank you. La, 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 la just proceed. La, just proceed. La, la, just proceed. La, just proceed, please. Now, now, la, la, just proceed. I mean, because time not now. Um, the president is statement for summarize. He say APC no able be a, they no able be a, suck here. We no, we no suck. As you see me, so you go no say we no add up. Even uh, Koto Alpha Khan, the tell be the APC opposition. It been get airline, it been get a very good business, it not been the suck. But now, now during SLPB time, we see say money not again. Low no down, they very clearly say APC will not get adopted manly. But again, um, 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 for conclude, my uh, sister Awasamai, uh, he talk extensively on the uh, 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 agreement for national unity. Of course, the agreement for national unity for me, now the Quran, every day they read them. I'm glad he will you raise a lot of points then and you say what will they do for they in line with the constitution i want let you also know say will not for be the moral guarantor for this particular agreement the resolutions then clear you don't clearly explain what the resolution one say the president for address the nation resolution two apc for go back and participate in governance we don't want resolution three now with the persona when are the tripartite committee but what in the happen to resolution four we say for release any political prisoner where they've been caged we commit some electoral offense or we've been there for some kind of protest during the electoral period therefore release them but certainly will not see the release of it you also say the the, the agreement is very clear you know ambiguous but again how you could define politically motivated cases where cases and they are caught right now which one are politically motivated case which one not a politically motivated case we don't know I think say we need for explain and better to people eh? because for me that the ambiguous when I ask a question about ECOMOC. Echo has I mean then gets the then committee we get for Canada this country according to the letter we may read, then they can't really for look into the national uh, the, the agreement for national unity and then get for me to the tripartite committee, government of Sierra Leone, and then they meet to the opposition, and then they monitor for no more the work then be good do not be to money, let everything come up fine. Me big brother say we not sanction any demonstration. Of course, you don't repeatedly re-echo my statement. I want to make it abundantly clear. Say APC not call for any protest or demonstration. We are a responsible political party. We respect the laws of this country. We will make sure say, we keep the peace in this country. Now we write for demonstrates chapter three of the nineteen ninety one constitution very clear. Freedom of assembly, the right to protest to get them. But we want to do that day. We will make sure say we write officially the authorities concerned. Uh, go do in a way that you know go disturb the peace 
of this country. Inside the program, the last voice we listen to, and I'm in Kyle Kuma, representative from the main opposition, the PC party. And same way, so inside the program, we get Honorable Alpha Khan, presidential spokesman, office of the president. Same way, so we get our Samai, executive sector independence commission for peace and national cohesion. As we look at issues we get to do with um, peace and national cohesion, when I have the control of the program. This is not a program. Do don't clean with with Baba the same old system and the same problem. So wait till we for the war, we never did. Wait for make this problem, yes, so when.